Hi, this is Troy Schuyler, Century 21 in Roseburg, Oregon, RoseburgHomesForSale.com, and I am shooting a video tour here. It'll be a walkthrough tour of a new listing that I just took out in the Elkton area. This is a riverfront home. It's a good sized property, about one and a third acres. You can see there's tons of parking out front here. There's a shop, garage detached. I'll walk you kind of around the back and show you the river view as well once we get through the house. It has a metal roof so hardly any maintenance there. This home could be perfectly set up for a two-family setup or uh, in-law quarters or mother-in-law quarters or uh, you know family member that needs their own space. Um, it does have a separate um, master bedroom on one end of the house that's a second master that could easily be um, converted into that second area. Little area for a kitchenette, and I'll show you that when we go through. Fruit trees out in front. There's an Asian pear, cherry, some apple trees. Elkton is located, oh, about a half an hour west of Sutherland, Oregon. So I'll go through and show you the house. walk in here you can see we have hardwood floors in the kitchen it's a dining room kitchen combo tile countertops nice big kitchen it's all bright has a nice view of the river right out the window fridge built-in microwave dishwasher and the stove range uh, oven all stay There's a neat sink in here, show you that, and the view out the back to the big deck. So it'd just be perfect for kids or for family members or gatherings, entertaining, whatever. So nice big kitchen, little breakfast bar area. Go in and I'll show you, most of the bedrooms are on this side of the house over here through this big oversized living room here you can see the cove ceilings up here don't see that kind of stuff very often anymore lots of light again coming in from the back southern exposure home wood stove heats the house nicely built-ins this home has built-ins everywhere lots of storage come in here give you a feel for this room hopefully i won't make you too seasick Remember, you can always contact me through my website at rosebergholmesforsale.com if you want more information on this or any other home, or if you want to schedule a viewing. There's the guest bathroom. You have four bedrooms on this side of the house and two bathrooms. Here's the master. I'm going to walk you down the hall before I show you the master because I'm going to walk you out back and show you the river once we go through there. There's one bedroom. Bedroom here. All updated vinyl windows. Bedroom here. So definitely a lot of room for a growing family. Here's the master suite, which is a good size master. Really, it is big. I'm going to show you the vanity over here. It's built in. And your shower and toilet. You look at the built-ins here. And it has built-in shelves right behind that door and that door. They had a TV up here at one time. Of course, the flat screen TVs you'd want to probably hang on the wall now. But then you have your closets over there. So lots of storage in this big master. So I'm going to walk you out back, show you the river, and then I'll walk you through the what I would call the guest quarters. I guess it could be set up for a bed and breakfast or, like I said, a mother-in-law quarters if you needed it. The river is just awesome. This is a really nice spot on the river. You can hear the river from the master here in the kitchen, in the living room if you open the windows. It has a huge deck. At one time they had a partial cover on here where you could 
probably do that pretty easily again. Either plant some grapes or wisteria up there or something. Cover part of the deck if you wanted it covered. Good sized backyard. Has a play structure off to the right here that was used by the past owner's kids. There's the side of the garage out there. I'd say it's probably a good 20 by 24 garage or shop. Pretty nice size little shed there. Some big trees. There is a, a staircase that's overgrown right now. Um, it'll be cleaned out here. Um, she has somebody come in to do that. So we have access down to the river on this property. So there is a staircase that takes you all the way down. I'm told this is a very good spot for fishing. And I do know salmon and steelhead run up this river. And so I would believe that because I've fished this river a lot myself. A little sitting area patio here. In the terraced backyard. Come down here and show you the backyard. She has a little bench here for overlooking the river. I just want to give you a better view of this river out here. There we go. Just a really nice spot. Slower water up here and the white water down below. Be good for swimming or fishing or whatever. Sits up high enough that from what I'm told it's not in the flood zone. I do know the neighbor had their property surveyed and the house is not in the flood zone. You can see it sits up quite a bit higher and so that's a good thing too and we'll verify that. But at this point the preliminary information I get that the home is not in the flood zone so you can actually buy a riverfront home without that high cost of flood insurance. Just under 2300 square feet total by the way. I don't remember if I said that or not. So you have four bedrooms, two baths on one side of the house and then on this side I'll walk you through the guest quarters over here. And there's a Murphy bed in this really cool sunroom. Be a great office or like I said, a guest quarter area. It could be their living room or separate family room, kid room, lots of light, lots of windows. She has a little tiki bar set up in here. This is the Murphy bed here that I'm looking at right now. Okay. And then you come up through here and this is that separate entrance. Uh, could be another master bedroom. It could be the family room for the guest quarters. It could be an office has its own entrance into the house and its own three-quarter bathroom here too. Toilet, sink, and a stand-up shower. So it could be easily occupied by somebody else without even interfering with the other tenants on the other side. And then the utility room here, it's a good size. This is where you'd put your kitchen at if you were going to make this a full-on guest quarters because you have the plumbing out here with plenty of room to do that. So again, name is Troy Schuyler, Century 21 in Roseburg. Got one to sell, give me a call. Love to help you out. You wanna make an appointment to view this home? You can reach me at 541-492-3647 or contact me through my website, www.roseburghomesforsale.com. Thank you.